that climb up Snowden in a snowstorm with a temperature ten below zero. And I'd claw my way up precipices like a regular mountaineer. Oh, and I wouldn't notice the icicles that were taking the place of my toes. If I thought I'd find you sitting on the summit, scotching an Arctic rose. If I thought I'd find you sitting on the summit, sketching an Arctic rose. Well, not quite, but nearly. And I'd queue for thirty days outside the Albert Hall for the last night of the proms. And I'd brave the hope and glory mob with their red, white, and blue tom toms. Waving their little Union Jacks, every one an embryonic Enoch Powell, just to watch you play your concerto number one for electric light bulb and towel. Just to watch you play your concerto number one for electric light bulb and towel. Well, not quite, but nearly. And I'd row to the other ends of the earth in my coracle tempest tossed. And when I hit a coral reef, and it seemed that all was lost, I'd swim the shark-infested seas till I felt like a washed-out squeegee. But it'd be worth it just to see you shinning up coconut palms on Fiji. It'd be worth it just to see you shinning up coconut palms on Fiji. Well, not quite, but nearly. I suppose I trudged through deserts when the sun was burning hot, and I'd hack my way through jungles. But on the whole, I'd rather not, because I think I'd sooner see you in a warm and friendly room, with nothing to divide us but the half light of the moon. With nothing to divide us but the half light of the moon. Yes, that's right, really.